a day off today and I'm on my way to BS Exhaust in Roscommon. He's going to do a job on my exhaust and make it a little bit louder than what it is. Not sure what we're going to be doing because you know money is not there to be spent on these cars when you're married with four kids. So we're on a budget. So we're just going to go down and see what he can do. He's in Roscommon. What it's like, I don't know. What his setup is like, I don't know. But I suppose we're going to find out. See you down there. Yeah. Welcome back to Gas. Is it on? It is. Welcome back, back to Gas Donkey. James is out with me today, but I've met Brian about three and a half seconds ago. I wrapped yeah. him in the deep end. We're here at BS Autos, and I like your workshop. Yeah. What is, what is it you do? So it's all custom exhaust fabrication. Yeah. For mainly for all kinds of vehicles, but mainly cars, Jeeps, vans, small bit of tractor work. Uh, but mainly cars. Rally cars. Some rally cars, uh, some race cars, but yeah, mainly kind of That's like you said. boy racers. Yeah, they travelled two hours to get here, but it's worth it. Yeah. Uh, and is it bog? Are you on bog land? Uh, no, but you're in a rural village. Geez, in are, cause where I'm from, it's bog and it's, it's very, very like it. And a nice so we're spot. in the Midlands, we're in Roscommon. It's um, nice, yeah. A small village called. It's nice. It's good location. I can see here you've loads of kits for your exhaust. Yeah. They look really well. Yeah. And my car's a bit quiet. Right. And I'm on a budget. Married yeah. to four kids, you know, he's have when he's yeah. not there. So I want to just make it a little bit louder, but I don't want it by racer louder. Okay. So what, what, what are you going to do? So I suggest probably take out the center resonator. Yeah. And um, if we remove the back box, I think it's going to be too loud. Yeah. So I think just remove the centre box and leave the back box in it. Okay. You know, it's a good difference. Yeah. It's very cheap. Um, and I think it's the cheapest option. It's uh, then if it wasn't loud enough, you could go into looking into removing the cats or a back box. Or you could put a performance box in it. There's lots of different options. But the cheapest, simplest, easiest way out is to remove the centre box first. Yeah, I just want a home. Yeah, so that's, that's a good option. Or do I think I'm mad? <laughs> I only met you and straight away your sound. Yeah. Because a lot of people you go into, you just kind of stand off and put your not too comfortable. Yeah. So, comfortable place to come in. We're going to see what you do. Yeah. And I'm going to go around with the camera if I'm allowed. Yeah. While you're working and see you in the back of few minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Back at 90 now on the we've changed our mind about what we're gonna do. Yeah. We're going with the back box removal into a nice dual tip. So I think it'll give it a bit more. So yeah. we'll try it anyway. See ya. We started off when we removed the back box. Yeah. It's a little bit different than what we're gonna do, but he's the expert. I'm not. So we're gonna take this back box out in a new set of pipes and see what that sounds like. Just going to show you some of the pipes that are here. This place, lads, is absolutely... It's like bringing your wife in to buy an engagement ring. Go, fuck. Look at that. I would have had it tidier if I knew we were doing these videos. Ah, no, doesn't matter. Guys, this is serious. If you're around, I link pages that you know exactly where this place is. The area code straight to the front gate. Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Brilliant.
up and we're going to hear what does this sound like. Hopefully it's not too loud. See you in a second. Brian, we're happy with that noise now. Yeah. And what you've done, you've cut my back pipe. Yeah, so, so your back box has been removed. Yeah. You don't want to touch down there, and this shows me how prof professional you are, because my cats are down there. Yeah. And you don't want to touch them. No. For the NCT reasons. Yeah, so you need your cat yeah. for the NCT. And there's another cat on further, you yeah, can see a smaller cat. Yeah. The cat up at the turbo, then you have this cat. Yeah. Well, why, why, do you think, why do you think the second pipe is coming out through there for lads at home? I'd say it's what um, this here on its own going direct through would have kept it too quiet. So it has the both options. This here has no silencer. This has yeah. the silencer. This is your flexi for a bit of movement. Um, so you have that's for that's a typical sports type exhaust like that. Yeah, because when I'm in the car, I can hear a bit of a rumble in the yeah. car, but it's just not enough. And coming down further, so then bypass from your resonator, then yeah, your clamp straight out. Straight out. Had your big back box on it. Um, so, so now we've decided, right, we're going to get rid of this back box. Yeah. So the first thing we did was cut it off, start it up, see what we thought of the sound wise. If it was too loud, we'd weld it back. Um, only takes a few minutes. Then we would have decided, right, we'd take out the center box and maybe if that wasn't enough. We can go with a bolt in, bolt out decaf. But that's where you're going into kind of more expense, yeah. um, bigger job. So we just said, look, we'll take off the back box. That's what we did. Um, sounds good, you have all your crackles pops, not too loud. And now we have to bend the pipe in and we have to choose our tip and we've come with this yeah. like three inch, um, kind of like a slash cut. It's an OD type tip, so and it just fits it perfect. We're not going to get into prices or anything because these videos have been on YouTube a long time and yeah. prices change. Yeah. So we're not going to bother getting into prices. That's, if a lad comes down to you, his pricing, it's every exhaust is different so we're, we're, yeah i don't want to get into prices because this could be up two years time yeah and prices change so that's last yeah. we asked if i didn't go into prices see so you, you're going to bend this and out yeah and the machine for bending it then yeah, is so over here here's the pipe bender yeah uh, i'm looking forward to seeing how that works uh, so you can type you can bend any exhaust for any guy yeah up to three inch and even at three inch that pipe bender is a bit under pressure and um, that's where you get into, once you go over kind of 2.5, you can go into a different type of bender, which is a huge one again. Yeah. Um, but it's it's the option if you're working on bigger stuff. But uh, maybe okay. down the road, we'll see. Yeah, down the road. Okay. Um, so that's where we're at. Right, I'll stay out of your way, so we watch we'll the, master, there. the master at work. Yes, I do. Happy with the tip. Yeah, I like the tips. But well, I'm following your, I'm following your advice because this is your trade. So if you're happy with them, I am. Yeah, I do.
black box is gone. You've run your pipe. Yeah. And your tips. So we've just spotted the exhaust pump. We want to double check and make sure it's right. Yeah. Um, we decided to change the tip from the power up and start. I'm fussy, am I? Yeah, definitely. I'm a little but, bit fussy. Well, that's what we want. Um, we want to make sure we're happy. We want to make sure the tip looks well. Yeah. So we're going to we have a spot it on now. We're going to let it down and have a look at it. And then we'll, we'll guide it from we'll there. We'll final yeah. decision on everything. But, I like it because I wanted something that's that you know yeah, it was done. It's not original. It's not no, standard. No. The first tip was very um, standard looking. It was. It was like the original, really. Only yeah. it had an in roll lip, and it was. Yeah. Um, but this is this is definitely more aggressive. The first one was three inch. This one's three point five yeah. inch. So we lower it down, and I don't know. We don't have to go down all the way. Should we go on? Just down a bit. Ah, yeah. We'll let yeah. it. Yeah. We'll see. And we'll have a look and see. What I like about Brian is he can talk to him, he can change your mind and he can play around with crazy things in your head. It might sound stupid in your head, but it's not. You can talk to him and ask him for his advice and I want something a bit crazy and this is it. Yeah. But sure, Brian, I am a bit crazy. Yeah. So we'll have a look at this now and just see. I like them. Like if you're going to get something done, why go standard? We know that it's going to sound good. Yeah, it's going to sound good. But it's going to sound a bit beefier than doing the, the middle yeah. box. Leave a comment below and let me know what you think, lads. Uh, Brian, that's, you need to go down any further. That's perfect. It's perfect. That's the one. Look at that, lads. <laughs> no, that's the one. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that's the one. Definitely. Yeah. Back in a minute. Brian, we came with one plan, but you're really with another. Uh, yeah, it looks, looks really well. Yeah. It's going to sound better. It looks fantastic. Yeah, definitely. And again, repeating yourself, what I like about you is I can talk to you. Yeah. If I have something in my head, I can throw it at you and you make it work. Yeah. So, BS exhaust, and I know you're making no money out of me today, yeah. but I would say thank you so much. Fantastic setup. Your area code straight to your front door. Yeah. It's not that far away. No, it's very much midland. It's very it's midland, midland yeah. yeah. So please subscribe. We have more fantastic programs to come on our channel. And from Gas Donkeys, thank you so much. Thank you, sir. And we'll see you again. Cheers. We've been down with other cars. A few other cars that I've been trying to get some work done. Yeah. Absolutely fantastic. Let me know on the link below what you think. But BS Exhaust in Ross Common, well worth a visit. Thank you very much. Thank you.